Washington, Donald Trump's former national security adviser Michael Flynn is now cooperating with investigators looking into Russian election meddling, an ominous sign that the president could be implicated in the ongoing probe. Flynn, a former army general, pleaded guilty on Friday to lying to the FBI about conversations he had with Russian ambassador Sergei Kislyak, one of which occurred at Trump Tower in December. 2016, with Trump's son-in-law and advisor Jared Kushner. Court papers indicate that Flynn said he was acting under instructions from senior Trump officials when he met with Kislyak to discuss sanctions imposed by President Barack Obama in retaliation for Russia's election meddling. He told FBI investigators on January 24, four days after Trump's inauguration, that he did not ask his flyer act to refrain from escalating the situation in response to sanctions, a court filing said. He also falsely stated that he did not recall the Russian ambassador subsequently telling him that Russia had chosen to moderate its response to US sanctions as a result of his request. A day after the Trump Tower meeting, President Vladimir Putin of Russia said Moscow would not retaliate against the United States in response to the sanctions. Trump praised the Russian leader in a Twitter post. Great move on delay, by V. Putin, I always knew he was very smart. Trump wrote. Get the latest news and updates emailed straight to your inbox. By submitting your email you are agreeing to Fairfax Media's terms and conditions and privacy policy. The plea marks a dangerous turn for the White House. As court documents indicate Flynn is cooperating in Robert Mueller's probe into possible collusion between the Trump campaign and the Kremlin. So far, no evidence of collusion has emerged but Flynn is the fourth Trump official to be charged. The first, foreign policy advisor George Papadopoulos, was dismissed by the White House as a low-ranking volunteer after he pleaded guilty for lying to the FBI about his contacts with a Russian professor who was promising to dish dirt on Hillary Clinton. The White House also dismissed the second case, against campaign manager Paul Manafort and his deputy Rick Gates, as involving people who played a very limited role for a very limited amount of time and involving charges that had nothing to do with Trump. But Flynn is the highest profile Trump ally, and the first aide who worked in the White House, to face charges in Mueller's investigation. Assuming Mueller is using the charges to leverage Flynn, the investigation has gotten much closer to the president himself.